Let's make one more tutorial in Autodesk Fusion. In this video, you'll learn how to use the extract, fillet, hold, and rectangular pattern. So open the Fusion and let's go. The first step to create this part, we will select the front plane and make this sketch. And here will be the midpoint. And the first thing that we'll make, we'll create this two arc here with 45 millimeters and the distance between these two arc is 5 millimeters and we will create this sketch here okay so open the fusion go to create a sketch and select the front plane go to create select the arc center point arc click here in the midpoint make an arc here with 45 millimeters of radius Okay, and go to constraint, select horizontal vertical, select this point and this one, this point and this one. Now go to offset, select this arc, 5 millimeters, the offset here, press OK. Select line, close the sketch here and close here. Okay, we made this. Now select a circle, make a circle here with 18 millimeters and another circle here with 25 millimeters of diameter go to sketch dimension the distance between the center of the circle and the midpoint is 75 millimeters and go to constraint select horizontal vertical select this point and the midpoint here okay now select uh, arc center point arc click here in this point make an arc here with 20 millimeters of radius okay and go to constraint select horizontal vertical select this point and this point here this point and this one now select the line make a line between this point and this arc another line between this point and this arc this go to constraint select the coincident select this point and this arc and this point and this arc okay we made this now finish the sketch we needed to extrude this so we will extrude this arc first 50 millimeters okay so go to extrude select this profile here the direction symmetric measurement polylength and the distance here 50 millimeters Operation new body, press OK. Go to sketch and show the sketch one. Go to extrude again. Now we will extrude this area. This area you need to extrude this 28 millimeters. So select this profile. The direction, symmetric, measurement, holy length, and the distance 28 millimeters. Operation join and press OK. And go to extrude again select this profile here we needed to extrude this 28 plus 6 millimeters 3 to this side and 3 to this side okay so it will be 34 millimeters direction symmetric measurement whole length and the distance 34 millimeters operation join and press ok Hide the sketch one. We made this, okay. Now we will create this base here, okay. This base has a rectangle here with 25 millimeters by 5 millimeters in the both sides, okay. So let's create this. Now go to create a sketch and select the front plane. Go to create, select the project included, project, select this body here in the selection filter select the body press ok now select the rectangle click here in this point make a rectangle here 5 by 25 millimeters and create another rectangle here 5 by 25 we made this finish the sketch and go to extract select this profile here and this one And here, 
We needed to extract this 30 millimeters, okay? So the direction, select the symmetric, measurement, whole length, and the distance here, 30 millimeters. Operation join, and press OK. We made this. Now we will add fillet. So we read a fillet here with three millimeters of radius in all this edge here, three millimeters of radius. And in the corners here, we have five millimeters of radius, okay? So go to modify, select fillet and select this edge here and this one. The fillet here is three millimeters of radius. Now add selection set, select this edge and this edge here. This edge and this one, the fillet here is five millimeters of radius. And press OK. We made this. Okay. Now we will create this hole here. The diameter, five millimeters of diameter and the distance here. 5 millimeters between the center and this edge and 10 millimeters between the center here and this the center and this edge okay so here select the hole select this face here we will we'll add a reference select this edge here 10 millimeters here and select this edge here add another reference Let me change the geometer here, five millimeters, and select this edge here. The distance here is five millimeters. And press OK. Now go to rectangular pattern. And the object type, select the features. The feature, select this hole here. The axis. And and set the axis, select this one. And the quantity here, two, two. And in this direction, the distance is 20 millimeters. And this direction here, the distance is 120 millimeters, okay? And press OK. We made this, okay? Now to finish this exercise, we needed to create this rib here. So it is a line tangent with this arc and it begins in this point here, in this edge. And the thickness here is three millimeters, okay? So go to create a sketch and select the front plane. Go to create project include project. Select the bodies here, select this body, press okay. Now select the line, click here in this point, make a line here tangent with this arc okay we made this we have this profile you can extrude this or use the rib features no problem so if we will extrude we'll need to make the both sides finish the sketch you can extrude this or use the rib in our case we will extrude this okay Select this two profile and the distance here is three millimeters. The distance, sorry, the direction, symmetric, measurement, whole length, the distance three millimeters and the operation join. And press OK. We made this. So here we finish our exercise. So thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel for more and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.